Official Watches, Ultimate Timekeepers of UCMMA. Welcome to the London Fight Factory. I'm here with the baddest referee on the planet. Yes, it's Granite Grant. Well, look at that chest. Grant, we're talking today about Anderson the Spider Silver. This guy has got eight legs or eight arms, but he's an animal. He's in there and he knocks people out. But you was in there right from the beginning at Cage Rage. What was it like? to referee the spider? Well, back 2004 was the first fight I refereed. Uh, Anderson Silva versus Lee Murray. The atmosphere back then, I mean, MMA was taking off big time back in the UK back then. Uh, Cage Rage was, you know, right up there. That fight, the atmosphere was one of the most intense fights I've ever refereed. Um, Anderson Silva, well, Lee Murray took Anderson Silva to the distance. That has never happened since. Uh, I mean, what a fight, just fantastic. Well, you gotta remember one thing. Lee Murray ripped off the Brazilian flag in the weigh-ins. With his teeth. Anderson was mad. He was fuming. In, in the weigh-ins, it was like that, remember? Yeah. I'm sorry. It was all like that. It went proper off in the weigh-ins. I was there, Murray was pumped. Anderson was just so angry. But after the fight, he, he had the Brazilian flag and, gave it and back. waved it to Lee Murray and gave it back yeah. to him. But yeah. Lee, again, bowed his head and went, yeah. you were the better man on the day. But what a fight. Well, that was one of the shows, 2004. It took Anson Silva to fight in the UK. We knew that he was a phenomenon. He was something special. You could just tell that every fight he had, he had four fights over here in the UK. Everyone was unbelievable. But it took UK MMA to another level. Another level. But let me tell you a secret. And not many people know this, Grant, apart from me and you, Andy Gear and a few little people. <laughs> Anderson Silva came to our gym and said on that night, done a little seminar for us, he said, I'm gonna show you this new elbow. And he was he was doing a back elbow, going, Bosh, this back elbow. And what did he do with Tony Frickland? This is when he fought Tony Frickland. He threw a fake right hand and came up with the weirdest elbow. No one had ever seen it before. We all called it the Anderson elbow. And we looked at each other after the fight and said, he told us he was gonna do that. Nobody believed us, but what a phenomenon. I just wish it was betting around in them days because we'd have been rich men. Now, let's talk about another one. And I run in the cage, I looked at you and went, why did you stop it? And this, this was four minutes, 59, <laughs> 59 seconds. seconds, but Curtis knock him out of stout. And I didn't really, I mean, Anderson's ground and pan is on another level. Ferocious, you know, we see a lot of fighters who um, at the lower levels, their ground and pound just isn't there. At Anson's level, his stand-up is phenomenal. His ground and pound is ferocious. Every shot he lands is doing damage. But he knocked out Curtis Stout right over the other side of the cage. Four minutes, 59 seconds. I could see that he was totally out, and I stopped the fight. One second to go. Everybody jumped up. I was fuming. What, I was fuming until, until I walked what's over there. And, you know, you came in. The medics came in. Uh, the crowd were looking. And the silver got up. And guess what we said? Curtis Stout didn't move. Grant Walkman is right again. God, I hate him when he gets things right. But 100% Grant, you're right on top of the action. People say, I'm not quite sure. But when you're right there, you know what's best. Yeah, I mean, uh, one thing I will say, you know, I, I was refereeing Anderson Silver back in 2004. Uh, there's guys now just getting into refereeing. I'd been refereeing for about five years before when that. I refereed Anderson Silver. Yeah, before that. So, you know, I had a huge amount of experience right then. So that's why I was getting it right back then. Well, you know what, from Grant Warren, from Dave O'Donnell, we've got lots of stories about the Brazilians, Vita Belfort, Vandalay Silva, Cyborg, we've got so many stories, but we can't Ninja, tell you. Shogun, we can't tell you because we're honor box. because we're honourable human beings. So <laughs> we will see you next time very shortly with Anderson Silva.